Hey guys, TechDude731 here, and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial showing you how to install unsupported printer drivers on Windows 8. This also works for previous versions of Windows, such as Windows 7 or Windows Vista. As you can see, I am currently running Windows 8, actually 8.1. You got the whole live tile interface here. So let's get right into this. The driver I'm going to be installing today is for an HP PhotoSmart 1115 and it is over a USB connection. In this tutorial I will be showing you how to do it for USB printers but this should also work for other connection types such as pr parallel printer port. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open devices and printers by right clicking on your eject thing and clicking open devices and printers or search for it either way just open devices and printers next you're gonna wanna go up to add a printer then you're gonna wanna go to the printer I want isn't listed now add a local printer or network printer with manual settings and here choose use an existing port this is gonna be your interface so mine is USB and then click next now you get to a list of drivers so first you're gonna wanna click this Windows update button that will update your driver list now you're gonna need to select your brand I am using an HP and then you'll see this which is the list of printers kinda like the subcategory as you can see laser jets and uh, office jets I'm using a PhotoSmart 1115 so I'm gonna go down to PhotoSmart and now when I go down to PhotoSmart as you can see PhotoSmart 1115 is not listed so you need to install another driver make sure at least it's the same subcategory printer and either look online on which one works or just try different drivers then you're gonna double click on the one you want to use I know for me HP PhotoSmart 8200 series works so click that you won't get this message just because I've installed this driver before and now you can name the printer I'm gonna name mine HP PhotoSmart 1115 click next it's going to install the driver here you can choose to share the printer if you want so that other computers on your network can see it this is good so you can make a USB printer kind of like a network printer however in this tutorial I will not be showing you how to do this click next now it should say you've successfully added HP PhotoSmart 1115 here you can print a test page or set it as the default printer I recommend printing a test page to make sure everything is configured correctly. If it's not, go back and try a different driver. And that's about it for the tutorial. Thank you guys for checking out this video. Like this video if you like this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below and subscribe for more videos.